In case you missed it, there is an art exhibition happening right now in downtown Toledo. It's celebrating a local Holocaust survivor, and our Laura Sandlin has their story. Artist Adam Grant painted his way to a better life. Early in life, he had always enjoyed painting. He was inspired by the great painters who preceded him, but his elder relatives discouraged him from pursuing art seriously. They told him that art would never earn the price of your bread. But then, during World War II, he was captured by the Nazis and sent to the concentration camps Auschwitz and Mauthausen, where he was given assignments to paint portraits and cards for the guards. And in exchange, he was on rare occasions given an extra ration of bread, so art enabled him to survive by literally earning him his bread. Following the war, Grant came to America, where he continued to pursue art through his work with the Palmer Paint Company, where he was the first designer for paint-by-numbers kits. Yes, those paint-by-numbers kits. Gallery manager Anastasia Wagner says that he continued to paint to help ease his hardships. I think that when people come here, they can find a connection to how art has it had kept him going and he kept finding inspiration and a reason to live in art. And this is how he built his new life. Wagner explained that throughout the gallery, viewers can see the progression of his art over the years and that he found joy in his new life. We have four pieces from his Renewed Hope series here in the Adam Grant Centennial exhibit and you can see symbols of joy and rebirth in this series. I hope that when people learn about Adam's story and see his work, they can feel inspired that art can give them hope and also art can earn you your bread. <laughs> the exhibit will be up through March 23rd and the exhibit is free to attend and all the work available is for sale. Reporting in downtown Toledo for WTOL 11, I'm Laura Sandlin.